of random, but I've been loving these waffles. They're green free paleo waffles and they're so good. But I've been eating them because I feel like when I when I'm green free and at least just like a lot of protein, I not only feel like just so energetic and so like good, but also my hair feels better and like everything feels better, my skin. So I like to eat that way, just makes me feel good. But I'm toasting a waffle right now and then I have to get somewhere by nine. So I have like 40 minutes until then. So let's eat some breakfast. knows how to play fetch we've been doing this for the past like month and he brings it back every single time so let's see if he does it with you guys ready go come on good job good job So I'm gonna go to that appointment. Then I have a call like right after that that I need to head home for. All right guys, wax was successful. I'm gonna run in, grab a coffee, and then I might grab one for my boyfriend too because he's working from home because the roads are just crazy. So I'm gonna grab that um, and then just head back home. And I have so many calls today. So I'm glad I'm getting this now because I'm gonna need all the energy I can get for this busy, busy work day. But um, I will show you guys what I end up getting. call and I'm so excited because when I went to the graphic design retreat a year ago now yeah it was a year ago now I met um, Moya oh hey Leo hi you want to come say hi I met Moya and she is amazing at Dubsado and she is just so good at like project management and she was actually my virtual assistant for a long time she was helping me with like Dubsado contracts invoices proposals all that and she taught me a lot leo he literally drinks anytime i have a glass of water leo wants it um but yeah she helped me a ton and i feel like i briefly touched on dubsado in my branding course and i believe i touched on it in my website course but i really just feel like dubsado itself needs a course on its on its own leo come on so I realized that I am just not an expert in everything. I want to understand how everything works in my business, but I think it'd be really beneficial to have her come in and teach the things she knows. So I'm doing a course with her second quarter of this year. We're going to launch that and we have it all listed out, um, the lessons and modules that we want to teach on, but I want to leave the floor open to you guys. Um, and I'm going to be posting this on Instagram and in my community what Dubsado 
like issues you're having or project management issues you're having in your graphic design business because we're going to go over all of that and she is just so good at all of this and i know she'll be able to help a lot of you as much as she's helped me too so honestly i'm going to be taking my own course because i'm so excited for the things we're going to go over but that was a really good call because we kind of went through and i I'm going to be filming part of the course and she's going to be filming part of the course, just kind of like casual screen recordings, walking through how to set up everything. Um, so I went through and kind of just selected the ones that I'm comfortable doing and the ones I prefer her to teach on since she's better at it. So that's what's going on. I'm so excited. So make sure to join my email list, join Instagram, do all that so you know when this is going to be kind of like built out and launching but not until like June of this year. So we got some time because I'm not doing it anytime sooner because this first quarter of the year, I'm working on a different course that I've been wanting to do. That's more for beginners in graphic design that want to learn just like the basics of logo design because my branding course goes really into like the client process, the client, the client relationship, but I want to do a course on the design part of it. So I'm very excited for that one because logos I just love so much and I'm gonna go into all of that so I'm very pumped about it but I feel really good about everything that I have going right now um I'm laughing because Leo's staring at me but right now I have a little bit of time until my next call at one o'clock it's 11 so I have two solid hours of work time so during this time, I'm going to fix my freaking Dubs Auto. I'm so mad at myself. So my email got overloaded and I wasn't receiving mail. And my Dubs Auto is connected to that email. So I, f I really messed up. I really did. Um, but luckily, I think it was only a few days of that, I hope. So we'll see. But I'm going to fix that right now. I'm going to work a little bit. Um, and I will talk to you guys after. Can I help you, sir? Can I help you? You're just gonna lay on my desk? Okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to get kind of ready, like do my makeup and stuff, because I have um, so many calls. I have a call at one o'clock with the copywriter I ended up finding that I'm so excited for. We're going to get on a call and talk about my website because we're going to rewrite everything. I've never actually like invested in that and I've been meaning to because I want it to be like very unique to me and sound like me right now. It just doesn't really feel like me in my voice. So I have that and then I have a call at three o'clock where we're presenting logos I created. So I'm super excited for that to see her feedback kind of get an idea of what she likes what she doesn't like and this is actually contracted out so it's not technically my client it's like I'm helping um, my friend in her little agency so got a busy busy day so I'm gonna get ready for all of that and then if I have time today I'm gonna film my wine and design for next week I try and do it a week ahead I've been trying to stay on track with everything and do that that way if anything comes up next week at least i'll have a video to edit so so far it's been working i've been doing pretty good at that um yeah that's what i have going on so i'm just getting ready for the video calls and stuff like that so anyway i washed my face and put sunscreen on i didn't just go right into this that'd be kind of weird but anyway, I also got this concealer, Born This Way. I've had it before and I loved it because it lasted me like forever. So I ended up getting it again and I'm so glad I did. I love it. For my skin, it works so well. It's definitely like more coverage than most, but I feel like the shape tape just like did not make my skin look good. It like would settle into my lines and just my skin was like almost too dry for it. This like formula works so well for my skin. Um, and I was nervous that it was too light of a color, but it's literally the perfect shade for me. I just, I'm so white right now. Um, but yeah, so I'm getting ready. I'm also gonna like make a little snack or grab me a little protein bar before this call because 
I know what typically happens when I have calls after calls between designs, I forget to eat lunch. And then I'm like starving at the end of the day. So anyway, busy day. I'm actually really excited right now because I um, sent out proposals last week and I hadn't heard back until today. Everyone's getting back to me today. And I've increased my prices this year. Not like crazy in my opinion. They're not super crazy outrageous prices now um but i do charge around five grand for logo and website so branding website honestly it probably could be more but i still want to work with those like newer businesses that are like not not huge yet so it works for them but yeah anyway that's what i i'm excited because one of the clients wants to go forward with the bigger package so I'm super pumped. And it's kind of like a confidence boost to keep on sticking with those prices. So anyway, I'm gonna get ready. I'm literally so dry. Like this is all settling into my dry spots. I gotta fix that. I'll talk to you guys a little bit. my call with my copywriter um, and it went really well so I'm very excited she's hopefully going to send me the first um, stab at my new website copywriting within the next couple weeks um, I'm very excited because I've never invested in something like this but I just know it's gonna be beneficial for me to kind of like build off of honestly designing for yourself writing for yourself is like the hardest I can do it for clients but when it comes to my own stuff for some reason it's just a lot harder so it's gonna be nice to have like a good starting point of like what to how to like explain myself and have my voice come through to come through words so I'm very excited had that call and then right now I'm actually looking at my air table um, and then I was also on Amazon because I um, I'm obsessed with this brand of sports bras it's super random I know but I'm obsessed with them. They're like the comfiest. They're like the perfect long line, high, higher neck, but they're just so flattering. I love them so much. So I just ordered. They only have four colors. They have green, pink, black, and gray. I have the black and gray, but I just ordered the green one because I, I really want them to get more colors because I'm just that obsessed with them. But I just did that because I've been thinking about it and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get it. So I did that. I... I'm just so busy today like I have another call coming up in 30 minutes and then I just had a new potential clients schedule call with me right after that one at 4 30 which is totally great that's fine like I have um time today to do that but I'm also like it's a long day long long day but it'll be good um but in the meantime I might go make myself another coffee um, like a little pick-me-up since I will be at my desk for the next like three hours again and then I think I'm also going to um, I need to design so my business coach that I've been using she needed some um, a refreshed look on her pricing guides for her wedding photography her bunch of her photography services sorry I'm like zoning out um, she needed a refreshed look to that so I I need to do one more for her do by tomorrow so we gotta get that done but that won't take me very long anyway let's go make a coffee i clearly am fading so i need that um and then i will talk to you guys i hope this call goes really well i'll actually show you guys before i go make that what um we're gonna be talking about because i designed logos for this client so we are presenting them on um keynote that's how this girl does it and my friend Susie this is how she like presents the logos I think that's a great way to do it so my animator that does like my YouTube intros he's creating an outro for me that I had this idea to do a cool outro so he's doing that and it'll like have the boxes like next video feature video and like subscribe Let's see if this is done okay so these are the logos um let me go to the 
front. How do you go to the front? Okay, anyway. Um, so these are just some of the logos I created, like this one. So this symbol um, is actually a Zimbabwe symbol, which we pulled in here and we kind of explained why we're using this symbol. I'm really digging this logo. I just feel like it's so luxurious, simple. Here, let me move my camera up. It's just like so simple and I feel like for what this lady is going for, it's perfect for her. And then I also manipulated the font to add like a wave in the A since it's like wavy hair. Um, and then I also added that on the bottom. And then for the submark, I thought it'd be really nice to have like an organic circle, not like a perfect circle. So those are like the color options. And then this is the second one. So this is actually a, so the lady that owns the salon, she's from Zimbabwe. And I found like a famous Zimbabwe, not famous, the national flower of Zimbabwe is a flame lily. So I drew that on my iPad and put it into like a really pretty frame like that. And yeah, we have that in here. And this is another one. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way. Am I? Nope, that was going the right way. Um, okay, so then there's this one, the one I showed you guys. That's why I was getting confused. Um, because it's frozen. Anyway, those are the logos. So we're going to be presenting those in a minute, but I'm pretty much good. I don't really need to do it much else for that. So anyway, let's go make a coffee, continue working, get on all these calls, and it'll be a good day. Just in time before my next call, my Amazon package was delivered. So let's go take a look. I know, I need to calm down. I went on Amazon the other day because I needed my new makeup sponges. And then I've been really wanting sweats. So let's see what they look like. Let's see what they look like. I don't know. I have a feeling they might be a little too like big because I saw the reviews after I bought them. I read the reviews, but then I didn't really like, if I'm being honest, I was like half asleep because I was laying in bed. Um, it's like a two tier thing. So that's pretty cool. And then I got makeup sponges. I actually just saw my sister order these and I'm like, oh, I need these too. So I ordered the same ones that she has. And I think she like raved about them. Here's the sweatpants. So they're a chocolate brown color, which I thought is very cute. Let's see what they look like. Okay, okay so they look like this. They do look pretty big, <laughs> but I kind of like them baggy. And they definitely are brown. I don't know why in the video they look like burgundy, but I think people rave about them because of this. Um, High waisted like top. Okay, these are pretty cute actually. I'm gonna try them on a little bit later. They have like that on the bottom. I thought this would be so cute with like a cropped mock neck long sleeve and then maybe like a cropped puffer vest. I thought that'd be a cute outfit. <laughs> we will see. Um, but you know, literally hurry up because I have a call happening like in two seconds. you guys I'm hopping on a connection call which I've been calling it a connection call because this is like before the discovery call where we're actually jumping into the work connection call is more like me actually just getting to know them and like seeing if we're a good fit understanding like their timeline I'm good thanks how are you sorry I'm good late. oh no worries I know it's late for you right it's 7 30 
throw away my Amazon box, but Leo loves it. <laughs> Why do you like it? You're gonna fall off the bench. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey guys, so I finished work for the day and I actually just made like a huge Caesar salad. I've been loving, I don't know why I've been craving like Caesar salads lately. So I made a big Caesar salad, I'll show you guys. And then we have leftover. I made a bolognese pasta last night and we have some leftovers. So I'm boiling some water to do some more pasta with it. Um, but yeah, I just made a delicious looking Caesar salad. So gonna eat that also these are the sweats they're like kind of huge but I kind of like them like big like that so these are what they look like I mean they're definitely so comfy but um like oversized in this area and it makes me feel like a little bit wide but they are so comfy um, so yeah I'm gonna make us some dinner and then just hang out I was just playing with Leo but my head started hurting so bad from looking at a screen. So I was like, I'm stepping away. And I'm probably gonna try not to look at a screen tonight, except for maybe I'll go on my phone for a little bit. But yeah, that's what's going on. Also, I got these muffins to make, and I might make them right now since I'm waiting for the pasta because I want these for like the morning if I'm ever like super busy or something. But um, yeah, I need to eat, I'm so hungry. Also, if any of you are curious what Caesar dressing I'm using, I got this one from Safeway, Asiago Caesar, and I liked it because very natural ingredients and just so much better than all those like chemicals and all the other dressings. So, and it tastes really good. I also have the same dressing in this flavor, balsamic ginger. Clearly, I'm a fan. Hey guys, good morning. It is Friday morning and I just went to a Pilates class. So I'm using this thing called Class Pass where I get to try a bunch of different workout classes for like $50 a month and you get like points that you can use. So I've been using that. So I just went and tried a new Pilates studio, which was okay. It wasn't like my favorite. I really like the one I go to. I just love the aesthetics of it. The workouts are really good. This one was a little more low key, which was fine for a Friday, but I did that. And then I went and got my boyfriend and I coffee since I was near the coffee shop and it's an oat milk. And honestly, it's like the cutest logo. It's so good. You guys watching are probably like oh my god she gets coffee all the time i do i do that's like my guilty pleasure it's like the one thing i love to go buy out um so don't judge me but anyway i just got that i'm gonna head home and work i have lots to work on today actually today's kind of more low-key i'm kind of happy about that because i finished quite a few things this week but today I need to start working on my course and I also need to plan out Pinterest posts, kind of do more like administrative stuff, like organize myself. And also I need to edit a logo and send that out today, but that will, won't take me very long since it's a super simple edit. So that's what I got going on today. And then we're also going to do a nice restaurant for dinner tonight. So that will be a nice little date. But um, anyway, I will, but yeah, anyway, I wanted to close the video out. I know I didn't really talk to you guys last night after I made dinner because at night, that's usually when I just kind of check out. And actually last night, I say check out, but last night I taught myself how to do animations and I'm very excited about it because it's much easier than I thought. And this is one of the courses I want to do this year is Procreate and like teaching how to use procreate like for beginners and then also like going into the animations 
of Procreate because it's so fun. And I was like up till 11.30 animating little drawings I've done in the past, which was awesome. It was so fun. So anyway, I wanted to close this video out and thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. That was scary. I hit a bump. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you did by giving it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below. And I'll see you guys in my next one.